How long does an atrial fibrillation episode normally last? Created by Upolife. Atrial fibrillation, also called AF, is a condition that causes the upper and lower's heart chambers to beat out of sync. In such a cause, an irregular heartbeat happens. Other symptoms may be present, as well. To make the diagnosis and treatment process easier, AF has been classified into four different types. Each type characterizes itself with different duration of the symptoms, among other things. In the majority of cases, the symptoms of AF tend to start benign. As the condition progresses, the symptoms progress as well. This means that both the duration and the intensity of the AF episode increase over time. However, some patients describe the AF episodes as constant. Therefore, the answer to your question of how long an AF episode lasts does vary by many different factors, including the type of AF itself. Determining the exact type of AF can help to create a treatment plan that has a higher chance of treating the problem. Here are the four AF types that differentiate one from another by length and intensity. 1. Paroxysmal AF. With this AF, the episode begins and ends spontaneously. In this case, the irregular heartbeat usually lasts several seconds. In the worst case scenario, the symptoms last up to a few weeks. Usually, symptoms resolve themselves, without the use of medications, within 24 hours. The treatment starts with lifestyle changes, for example, the elimination of caffeine and stress. 2. Persistent AF. This type of AF also has a tendency to start spontaneously. However, the difference is seen in the length of the episode itself. Most patients report experiencing symptoms longer than 7 days. Although the symptoms tend to worsen over time, there are some asymptomatic cases of persistent AF too. Persistent AF will not go away on its own without proper medications. Some cases may even require a surgical procedure. The treatment plan may include anticoagulants, beta blockers, and calcium channel blockers. 3. Long-standing persistent AF. This type of AF can last up to one year without any interruptions. In most cases, the cause of long-term AF is structural heart damage. In this case, more invasive treatment methods are used since medications, and lifestyle changes cannot eliminate the symptoms. Therefore, things like electrical cardioversion, catheter ablation, and pacemaker implantation are commonly used. 4. Permanent AF. This type of AF develops as a result of a long-standing persistent AF. With the permanent AF, people continue to live their life while their heart is constantly in AF. Unfortunately, research shows that the symptoms can evolve into much more serious and severe symptoms. Conclusion. To make a proper diagnosis, your doctor will ask how long an AF episode lasts in your case. Sharing any methods that you find useful to decrease the present symptoms can be helpful as well. Also, identification of the potential cause that may lead to these symptoms is highly important. Make sure that you are ready to answer this type of question during your doctor's visit. Learn more about how to evaluate your heart health and manage your heart condition at home by visiting upolife.com. Thank you.